What's happening out there everyone? It's Roll Easy here and I'm back with another GTA 5 online video. In today's video I'm going to show you an even easier method on how to hit the gift cards to friends glitch. You don't need a jerry can, no setting your friend on fire, nothing like that. And that was pretty freaking easy and there's barely any timing here. Well, there's really no timing here whatsoever. You just got to get it, you just got to hit it right. It can fail sometimes, but I'm telling you it's mad easy. So we're going to go ahead and go over the founders that will be Macclesfield UK and a few of his friends found this. I'll leave his link down in the description. Obviously, what you need is a facility. Uh, you want it to be full, all right, full of RHAs, anything you want to write over, okay? And then you're going to be using a streetcar, and obviously you need a friend with a vehicle that he's going to be giving you. Now, if you're using this as a money glitch, you both need the same custom plate in your iPhone. I'm going to go over that right after I get this car right here in the tutorial. But uh, yeah, so stay tuned after I get this car and explain how to do it. Uh, while I'm going into the facility, I'm actually going to go over how to use this as a money glitch because some of you guys are getting screwed over with getting dupe detected and things like that. So, as you can see right here, I have a streetcar. I have the full alert. I'm just going to go ahead and back up off that full alert. You don't need to do that. I was just checking, okay, to make sure it was full. Now, open up your phone, okay? Your friend is going to sign in as a CEO, and then he's going to send you an invite to his CEO. While your phone is open, just drive over to where the yellow circle would be. I'm right over the yellow circle. I'm going to go ahead and accept his CEO invitation, and then immediately the full alert should pop up. Accept it, open up your interaction menu, and take the easy way out. Now, that might not always work. Sometimes the full alert just won't pop up. If that doesn't happen, just reset and do it again. Not very difficult, all right? So now, once we're at this point, go ahead and leave your friend CEO. He could also retire if, if, you, know, if you don't want to do that step. That's totally fine. Either way, you just have to leave the friend CEO, okay? Now, before you get into your friend's car that you want to get, all right, you know, that you want to receive, open up your interaction menu. That is very important. Open up the interaction menu. Make sure the car is over the yellow circle, okay? Now, you see I got off the interaction menu. I should have gotten the full alert right then and there. But look, my friend Deadpool over here, you know, shout out to him. He was in a public session with us. He helped us out. He hopped into the car and I'm here and I'm just like, yo, I'm bricked. The second he hopped out, look at that. I got the full alert. Okay, so make sure nobody hops into the car with you or anything like that. But it's that easy, guys. I just received a car that easy. It's super quick and easy to do. Go ahead and do this glitch. Now, while we're going into the facility, I'm going to talk about using this as a money glitch. Say you guys want to give each other retros. You guys must go into your iFruit app and have the same exact custom plate on both of your accounts, okay? If I'm giving my friend a retro with a plate that says Roll Easy, he also needs a plate that says Roll Easy in his iFruit. So we both need the Roll Easy plate and the car that he's giving me needs to say Roll Easy on it or the car that I'm giving him has to have the Roll Easy plate. Okay, well you saw right there, I just overwrote one of those Sanchez's I had there and that's it, I have the car. But anyway, so as for the money glitch, that's how you guys avoid dupe detection. Those cars are able to sell as long as you both have the same custom plate in your iFruit and the cars you're giving each other have that custom plate. That's how you guys need to go about that. Okay, that is very, very, very important. All right, so now we're gonna go back to this gift cards to friends, normally using modded cars and stuff. Uh, as for any of these facility gift cards to friends glitches or the solo dupes that have been going around, you guys, when you drive this vehicle out, it immediately will brick on you and kick you out. You won't be able to get back into it. The way to gain access to the vehicle is to either swap characters, so go to your second character fully and then go back to your first character. You'll have access to all the vehicles in the facility. The other way is to completely close app and restart it. Okay, those are the two ways. I recommend swap character. All right. So now really quick, I'm just going to show you the perspective of the helper. So that's the car that my friend wants to get. There's a street car coming that he's going to be using. So we're going to get set up right here. I'm going to go ahead and invite, I think it's BMX over here. Shout out to BMX and Mr. Mod for helping us out, uh, you know, to make this video and teach you guys how to do this. So I'm going to send BMX an invite to my CEO. He has a street car. He's pretty much going to go ahead and open up his phone right now so that he loses the yellow circle to his facility and then he's just going to drive up right over the yellow circle. So you see his phone is up, he's going to drive up to the yellow circle. I've just offered it or I think I'm going to offer it right now. I kept getting messages in the top left. PS4 needs to really fix those messages, man. They get right in the way of the interaction menu. So right here, you see I'm going to go ahead and hire BMX. He just got an invite. He has his phone up already. He's going to go ahead and accept my invite. He should get the full alert right away. He's going to accept the full alert. And then he's just going to go ahead and take the easy way out. All right. So right now you're going to see him accept it. There we go. He accepted it. He got the fuller. He accepted that as well. And now he's just going to open up his, his interaction menu and Ewo. All right. Easy way out. Just like that. So now that he's done that, he will spawn over, you know, somewhere around here, around the facility. 
and he's gonna go ahead and leave my CEO, okay? Uh, also, remember, I can retire, but as you can see in the bottom left, is no longer a member, all right? So he left by himself. I could also retire and kick him out that way. So he's gonna open up his interaction menu, and as he opens up the interaction menu, he's gonna go ahead and hop into the vehicle, all right? And he's gonna get sucked in and accept the full alert. That's pretty much it, guys. So I'm, I hope you enjoyed the video and learned something. My name is Roll Easy. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you're brand new by hitting that big red button. Turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video and the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. Road to 25,000 subscribers. Peace out, guys.